So one of the country's top rated fine arts festivals kicking off tomorrow right here in Palm Beach Gardens. That's right, and preparation already started. Artie Gras is returning for its 37th year, so we're going to sit outside to Suji Nam. Uh, you're having a blast out there. You're live at the Gardens North County District Park, and Suji, set up for the festival is in full swing, so it seems. Good morning, Mark. Good morning, Caroline. That's right. Well, people are slowly starting to set up right behind me, and this is where that festival is going to be happening. It's going to be fun with lots of food, entertainment, demonstrations, of course, beautiful art. I'm here joined by John Carr. He's the chair of Art. John, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Oh, thank you for having me. Tell us about what's going to be different. What's new this year? Yes, we're excited. We have a lot of new things, but I think the most exciting thing is our art of food. It is our chef showcase where local chefs will be uh, preparing some of their favorite dishes and letting our, uh, you know, our people taste it and see what they think. Now, what's your favorite part of Art de Gras? Well, the art is always beautiful, but I love the community aspect of it. You know, it really brings community together, and we're real excited about that. So seeing some old friends, meeting new friends, but really the art is just phenomenal. And, and then watching all the kids with their art for Artie Kids, it's, it's awesome. And there are going to be hundreds of artists across the country coming out here. Tell us about that competition they'll be able to participate this year. Yeah, so we're always excited about that. It's a juried art show, and we have uh, almost 300 artists that are going to be here this year competing for awards, such as the Best of Show and some categories, so it's pretty exciting. And it is a family-friendly event. Tell us about some of the things that kids can do out here as well. We have this whole section called Artie Kids, uh, where they've actually submitted their artwork and bounce houses and just fun things for kids to do. There's They can do some art. So yeah, it's it's definitely family friendly. Uh, encourage everyone to bring their kids to get over to Artie, uh, Artie Kids right around the corner here. And there are tickets you can purchase ahead of time, is that correct? Yeah, so tickets are on sale. They've been on sale. So if you get them today, they're a little less expensive. Uh, so you can buy them at pre-discount today, but they are on sale now and you can get them at the gate. Uh, so I'm pretty excited about that as well. You can come right up and get them here. John, thank you so much. What a thank great you. way to spend President's Day weekend with your friends, families, loved ones, and we hope to see you out here. Reporting live in Palm Beach Gardens this morning, Suji Nam, WPPF 25 News. It's going to be a fun weekend out there. Thank you, Suji. Love it. All right, just a reminder, WPPF 25, the proud exclusive TV sponsor for Artie Gras and our own Chris Martinez and Mike Lyons. They're going to be there all throughout the weekend presenting a whole bunch of awards.